The Mario Party series has inspired no end of joy amongst the game playing populace and creepy competitiveness which destroys friendships. And now we've got another one. Here's Mario Party 8. It seems the residents of the Marioverse have very little to do but party these days. After all, with Mario Galaxy still on the horizon, why not fill up a few balloons and livers and take it easy with a few colorful friends? Whenever the exotically skinned wallets of Nintendo execs get a little light from celebrating Wii sales at the Baccarat tables of Vegas, they get on the phone and have the boys and girls at the game lab whip something up for easy distribution. <laughs> this time around, Mario's letting me's into the party. Maybe you'll recognize this beloved X-Play employee about to embark on a dangerous adventure. Don't worry, it's his job. Rob, are you okay? Give me an off-fat double cap. Party 8 has swapped the magic orbs of Mario 7 with magical candy. Apparently, magical orbs are more powerful than magic candy. With orbs, you can alter the track. With candy, well, you can't do that. With candy, you can sprout demonic wings and drain five gold coins from your unsuspecting victim's wallets. Not that thrilling, really. There's a few interesting things you could spend the game's local currency on, but we would have liked the expense to have yielded a bit more bang for the buck. MC Ballyhoo in his chatty top hat introduced the Star Carnival as the source of your gaming pleasure. The carnival theme is touched on a bit. You'll be able to accrue tickets redeemable for general digital knickknacks, but generally, you'll move right to the game boards. A moving train, Goomba's Booty Beach, and Donkey Kong's Jungle Hideaway lay in wait for your number-crunching blows. There's even a level that lets you take on the spiritually bankrupt world of real estate investment. Find a hotel that Peach owns, for example. Invest a few coins more than she did, and BAM! That adjustable rate mortgage she thought would never go up has just put her out in the streets. Yeah. The pace is fast, as you'd expect. And after every round, trademark minigames are nicely varied, combining shooting, driving, memory, and dexterity. As with anything that comes in abundance, there's a share of games you hope won't come back around. Finish! You may get the sense that having the Mario Party series in the hands of one developer over the years is maybe taking its toll. <laughs> the levels are interesting, but the graphics lack the snap that should by now be expected from next-gen consoles. We'd like to see Mario Party 9 really step up and address some of these issues. We would also like to see Mario Galaxy release now a 3 out of 5. Catch an all-new X-Play weeknights at 8, only on G4.